So, Noob Noob, how do you feel about the Acolyte? I need more strang women with my lightsabers. And more lightsaber diddling. More lightsaber diddling. So, you know you need to react to a trailer when you know, when you see the YouTuber Moon do a reaction to the Acolyte. And everybody seems to be big mad at this trailer. And I don't know why, because it's kind of like nothing. Right? It's got those lightsabers. It's got yellow lightsabers. It's got some green lightsabers. Maybe it's got some a blue, lot of colors. Some red, a <laughs> lot of colored lot lightsabers. Of colors. I don't know why the black chick's got the red one. A little racist, but oh still. Oh my god. So, well, we don't know. Do we know that for a fact? I'm pretty sure her hand is in it. So we'll check because we're going to look. We're just going to skim through the trailer. We're going to talk about this a little bit. We're going to look at a couple articles. So let's get started with the trailer itself. Look at this fuzzy little guy. Don't he look so cute? He's a youngling, probably <laughs> gonna die. Oh my god. Most younglings die in these Star Wars things, don't they? Just you know, kill the other one, not the cute one. So kill all the the, the white children. Kill all the human ones. Kill the human children. Hey, well, you can kill that non-blinking one too. <laughs> yeah. So that the guy literally creepy. says like close. So here's the here's the one thing that's kind of weird to me. They say something along the lines of like your eye, you can't trust your eyes. How does that connect to the rest of this trailer? Uh, what do you mean? You're saying you can't trust what you're seeing? He's, that's what he says. He goes, close your eyes. You can't trust what you're seeing. But how does that connect to the so rest of the trailer? So it's a fake trailer. I don't know. <laughs> I'm confused. Is this not an actual show? I mean, I don't know. Maybe Is this it is. actually a season, tra a, a sneaky trailer for Obi-Wan 2? Yes, it is. So uh, that's the guy from Squid Game. Yes. And he's like some sort of Jedi master. Could have swore he was Ken Watanabe, but then I was wrong. Is, no, you are very wrong. And then, uh, you know, th where's the kid with the un... There there's a kid with that who can't blink. And they tell him to close his eyes and he can't. And to me, that's, that is bigotry right there. The unblinking eye. All the other <laughs> kids have their eyes closed. Yep. Yet this kid cannot close his eyes. You bigots. He's always searching for eating that booty. You bigots. How dare you? Oh, and there's Carrie Ann Moss. Yep. And uh, she doesn't use a lightsaber. Did you notice that? She just uses the force. The force is her ally. Yeah. So she will use the force. I mean, she's in the Matrix. She don't need no lightsaber. So how did you feel about this fight scene? Did you think that this looked like interesting? These no, two this strong one didn't look great. Each other? Yeah, no, this one didn't look great. The the ending where there's like more sabers and stuff. You I'm just like, like all the, right. the, the dazzling lights. I quite literally just care about the pretty colors. Yeah. And then this chick, I guess, is like a Sith, but not a Sith. She's using a dagger. I She's feel like if you use the lightsaber a, against someone who doesn't use a lightsaber, you got a good chance of cutting off a thumb at least. Yeah. Right? She seemed kind of like a shitty Sith if she was one. They made the entire show around that actress. Oh. Let me just tell you that. So apparently they're scared to go in the woods. Where are all the rat tails? I'm looking for more rat tails from the Padawans, right? Uh, oh, you mean the hair thing? Yep. I was like, what are rat you talking tails. about? Yep. Uh, there's a Wookiee. I do like Wookiees. Wookiees are okay. They're very furry. <clears throat> and then there's some Jedi mind tricks, which aren't that interesting, because that's the guy from uh, Squid Game. There's some spaceships. Uh-huh. So far, nothing's really happened. Wasn't I told that Yoda would potentially show up? Yes, Yoda might potentially show up, but, uh, you know. You Is Yoda going to have a lightsaber? I hope not, because I don't like Yoda with a lightsaber. Why? He's, like, so quick and agile. What? what how does that make that good? What do you mean? He's like, I'm a little old man. He's like, oh, I'm a ninja. That's not that good. So Carrie Ann Moss still fighting without a lightsaber because, you know, she don't need no lightsaber. No, she doesn't. And then there's this spaceship crashing. Okay. It's a thing. It not looks super. cool. It looks like they sank a lot of Does money it, into this. Do you think so? It looks a little cheap to me, or at least poorly directed. Like, you really think this I'm looks I'm going to guess good? it's Disney Plus, so it's probably poorly directed. It is Disney Plus. There's so. probably too much money, and it looks cheaper than it should be. And you know who Leslie Headland is, right? No. Who does she work for again? She was uh, Unclear? trafficking young, allegedly trafficking young girls to Harvey Weinstein. No, oh, that girl? No, the showrunner, oh. Leslie Hedlund, not the actress here. Oh. No, not her. Maybe her, but not no, not her. Okay. 
And then there's she's like going to backstab a Jedi for some reason. That's oh, rude. and it's not about who's good or evil. It's about who gets to wield power, which... So they're making the bad guys the good guys, which seems strange to me. And the Jedi are evil now. Uh, You know what? The Jedi have always been evil. We just didn't realize it. Fair enough. Yeah. Look, the Acolyte is showing us the way. The way. The red... Je the, look her hand so yeah. it clearly she has a, a red lightsaber yeah. why does she not use it against carrie ann moss oh there's a blue and a green the, yep you got a blue you got a green you got a yellow oh, oh my god look at all the flashy lights i love them so many flashy lights and then uh you get the oh i don't know is this like a ring or something like what's the ocalite the seven rings of power of ocalite oh like shang chi is gonna power. show up and help so we'll leave it on all the jangly key chains there. Yep. So you love your lightsabers. I don't think people could actually see all them beautiful, glorious lightsabers. I do love me some ladies. So the Accolade trailer has 270,000 dislikes as uh, Star Wars fans share their collective disappointment. I feel like there's she... been shittier trailers from Star Wars. Name one. What's a Disney Plus? Uh, Ahsoka. Ahsoka is worse than this? I would no, right? I would think so. I don't I don't know. I don't know if I agree with that. So uh fans share their I don't know what they're disappointed about though, other than it just looks boring. It's just a and trailer. They have multiple seasons. It's not even a trailer, it's like a teaser. It's a mystery thriller. Like I'm not gonna know what happens and it's not gonna end up being palpatine, right? Oh Half my god, is it? How does it not? Although this is a this is the first series that is definitively outside of all of the movies. This is a hundred years before the prequels, so maybe we'll get more Jar Jars. I think you just spoiled it and said Palpatine is a bad guy. I I have no idea. I'm just guessing. I literally have no idea. Uh, it has 155 thousand likes, but 270 thousand dislikes. That is a lot. That is a lot. Several comments were were disappointed. What did you see? Close your eyes. What do you see? I see the dislike ratio. Oh, okay. Uh, what what can I see? Close your eyes. What do you see? What else can I watch? What do you see? I see Disney never understanding who their fan base is and never giving them what they want. Oh, okay. Well, what what do they want? I don't know. But I'm I'm going to say this is this is not good. I mean, maybe I'll watch it. Oh, by the way, you want to know what she pitched the show as? You're not going to watch it. There's no chance. I'm not going to watch it. No, yeah. there's no chance. I will be doing many rants on this, I am yeah. sure. Uh, she said it's Frozen meets John, what? not John Wick. Hold on. What did she say? She said it's Frozen meets something else. Die Hard? No, not Die Hard. Harry Potter. Yep. Uh-huh. The fact that she mentioned Frozen, I'm immediately out. You're immediately out. Does that mean uh, they're going to be singing? I hope not. Uh, and they and they say, uh, this is from, I don't know what website this is, fastcompany.com. DEI is not why Star Wars is getting worse. Really? Then what's the reason? You tell me. You tell me. They're saying, where did it go wrong? They're blaming the prequels. <laughs> wow. That's going hard in the paint. They're prequels just saying are good. George Lucas sucks. Prequels are the best part. Wow. So why is this? Then that means that if this is before the prequels, then it sucks. Apparently, it broke the Lucasfilm record for most views in a single day. Of hate views. Of Yes, there's a lot of hate views. Oh, my gosh. It's up to 343,000 thumbs down. Uh, that's a lot. That, that is, is a lot. lot. Yeah. Hey, thumbs down still earns your money, so that's that's fine. Yeah, it does. We know. Woe Clash. Um, so, okay. So that means we're saying that we love the acolyte. We are all in. We're both going to watch it and dress up as all the characters. Yes. Absolutely. Cosplay. <laughs> we will cosplay as the characters. What did, okay, hold on. I got to Google this now. Um, frozen meets acolyte. If I could spell it right. What did she say? Frozen meets Kill Bill. There you go. That sounds like a comedy. <laughs> what part of... Does she get married in either of those? <laughs> I'm confused. Is not the protagonist of Kill Bill called the, the bride? Yeah. Okay, so how do you mix Frozen and Kill Bill? I don't know. 
Well, all right, then. Singing and swords. Singing and swords. Let my lightsaber go. Let it go. Right? I guess so. And then Carrie Ann Moss and Lee Girl just, you know, make out a little bit. Oh, my God. What if they're Scissor Sisters? I hope so. Yeah. Maybe I'll watch. Well, why don't you let us know down in the comments if you think, did you give a dislike to the Acolyte or did you give it a like? We gave it neither because we're potentially going to cosplay as every single character, especially Noob Noob as Carrie Ann Moss. Absolutely. 100%. That's going to happen. We're barely negative Star Wars fans. We are positive Star Wars fans. What are we? I don't know. Anymore. I'm going to shave my pubes into a lightsaber. <laughs> Just for you? Yeah. That's a thing that could happen. I will. Anyway, uh, let us know in the comments below. What do you think? Are you excited for this? And uh, do you want us to make videos on it? I'm going to rant about it regardless. So either way, like and subscribe. That's the thing we tend to forget. But you can also check us out. We have a audio podcast on iTunes and a live stream here on YouTube alongside rumble you can catch us here friday nights 7 30 p.m eastern standard time come join the fun come join the channel you can support us and help feed a starving noob noob look at him he can barely afford to pee straight i can't pee straight can't pee clear i just pee blood that apparently yes he need his medical bills he may be dying support a starving noob noob with medical issues please do so it's a lot of (laughs) It's a lot of fun. Anyway, one dollar can help me stave off all these STDs. Yes, it is like he needs to clog up his pores with anti STDs. Anyway, my, get my swimmers checked. So, in the meantime, I guess we're just on to the next one because that's what we do. Mm-hmm.